All right, guys, we're gonna be doing a little toy hunt. Well, actually, this is gonna probably span in the next couple days. Also, guys, I am gonna be going to LA Comic Con this Sunday. Stay tuned for that. Which is what, December 3rd? Damn, I thought this uh, Target closed at 11. This one closed at 10, this particular one. But a lot of them do close at 11. Um, so I got, I got like five minutes. Damn, I think I'm the only one here. Just wanna see what they have in the figure section. Oh, they got the Spider-Man No Way Home stuff here. Tons of these. Bishop. Oh, man. Oh, they got new Joes here. Definitely have some new Joes here. Power Rangers. Aquaman. Sinestro. Flash. Joke. I haven't seen this guy in a minute. Wonder Woman. Who's that? Black Manta? Okay. Whoa, these are new. Pretty sure these are new. What else do they have? Whoa. Always gotta draw figures, right? Yeah, I think these are new. And then, dude, I haven't seen this one. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Five minutes. five minutes, guys. Oh, this, no, I don't know, Sarah, this is new. All right, I gotta look at the NECA section and the McFarlane section on this side before they close on me. Time is running out. Oh, I think it's smashed. Red Robin, which I'm assuming is surprisingly probably still not on clearance. Oh, we got some Batman animated. Oh man, there's like a, is this new? Okay, see like this one, I don't even know if I've seen. Okay, Copperhead, I don't know if that's new or not. Look at that, turtles. Oh, I think I better leave now. They're starting to eye me. Yeah, it looks like it's about it. I better go. I got to scan through. I think I'm the only one like back here. Is that a metal head? Oh, is this the hundred and... I was gonna say $109? Look, look at that. He-Man, the original complete series. All right, I'm gonna scroll through this side really quick before I head out. See if there's anything new. And it doesn't look like they're freaking snow troopers. Some... Oh, here's this thing. There's a few of them here. I don't know if there's any new wrestlers. Yeah, I better get out of here. They're gonna close like in like two minutes. So on to the next day. What's up guys? Today is the next day and uh, this, can, this is gonna continue the toy hunting stuff. Now, I'm gonna try to hit some game stops. That's, that's my goal because if you guys don't know, I've done reviews already for the McFarlane, Batman and Robin figures. Um, they are in stock on Entertainment Earth. Link in the description down below. Just the Batman and Robin, not the Poison Ivy, not the Batgirl. And from what I hear, GameStop's getting these first, but I don't think in my area, we don't have them yet. I really don't think they're down here yet. But um, I'm gonna try to hit a couple GameStops, plus Targets and Walmarts on the way, and see if we can find any of those figures. Um, but I do have reviews up on those, check them out. Have you guys? found any let me know in the comments down below because I know people are like tagging me in photos that they have them um, uh, I don't think people have found like the fully complete set but it seems like it's just like really scattered but that is the plan for today at least some of the to stores today and then uh, maybe a few of them tomorrow too so this will be another long toy hunting video I might hit some Burlington's and Ross's along the way as well all right, this will be the first of, I don't know how many Game Stops. I'm, prob I'm like saying I'm gonna do a lot. I'm probably only gonna do like two or three Game Stops to be honest with you, but let's give it a shot and see what they have here. Oh, well, they got their music playing here. Let's see, I don't know where they keep, oh, they got a Jim Gordon. I wonder if they took all of the Batman and Robins or if they ever even had them. It's all empty here. Tell you this much though, there's a lot of stuff like all over the place here. Like all the stuff they have, pops. Here's some of the figures. They got some Star Wars figures here. A lot of the Christmas, Christmas stuff. Harley Quinn, Wolverine. They got some deceased here. Uh, this one definitely has a lot of um, Funko Pops. They got some Diamond Select statues up top too. Clearance. This is Diablo. No, I don't see, what was that, Dungeons and Dragons? Yeah, Dungeons and Dragons over there. Diablo figures. 
No. I think if they did have anything, it would have been in this area right here where there's like no DC multiverse stuff. It's just like completely empty here. And then a lot of Nintendo on this side. All right, so I was talking to one of the workers there and he said that they haven't gotten any figures for over six months. Uh, it doesn't make any sense because that Jim Gordon figures, I don't think is six months old. I mean, I could be wrong, but he claims this is not a big figure store. They got a lot of action figures in there. Either way, no loss. So Walmart's right back here. And then we got a Target up front and then we got a Ross too. So I guess we can hit Ross. The parking lot for this area is, gets really crazy. And I think a lot of it has to do because there's an in and out. I mean, it's a big shopping center here. They got a lot of stores, but I, the main problem for traffic here is, um, is in and out. I mean, if you guys have an in and out by you, I'm pretty sure you know how crazy the lines can get. So I'm gonna try Walmart, see if they have anything here, Target, and then uh, we'll go to um, uh, Ross. Well, they have WandaVision. They have a Steelbook of WandaVision here. I know I didn't really care for that show. They got the Expendables on Steelbook too. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's right, Oppenheimer came out. I totally forgot about it. You know, I have not seen that film yet. I gotta watch that. All right, let's see what they have over here. So here is Funko stuff. Oh, they have the Spider-Man set right up top. That's a really cool set though. Uh, more Funkos, some NECAs, some horror stuff. Dude, look at all these turtles, man. What the heck? What is this? Halloween Kills Nightmare Part 3. Well, let's see what they have. They got, I think this two pack was here the last time I came. Oh my God, it's all freaking Donnie's. It's all Donnie's and Leo's. Yeah, it's all Don. I don't think I've ever seen this many Donnie's or Leo's before. That is a crazy amount of these. Looks like there's another section on this side. They got an end cap. So we got some, uh, well, nothing too crazy. We got the new Loyal Subjects turtles right there, foot soldiers. And then last time I was here, they had figures like scattered throughout here. It doesn't look like they have it this time. Okay, here's the DC multiverse stuff. And oh, they got Black Lightning still. Jim Gordon, Aquaman. This has kind of gone down since the last time I was here. They still got a lot of Black Lightnings though. There's a Black, or um, a Captain Adam there. Page Punchers. I think these might be all Aquamans? No. Nope. They got the Batmobiles. The Flash figures are still here. And there is stuff up top still. And some of that stuff that's been up there has not moved. Oh look, I think they have some new Star Wars figures. I don't know if this is new actually. These might not, these might not be new. Luke, this is, a, this is a new snow one that I haven't seen, a Christmas one I have not seen. Some stuff at the bottom. It's pretty stacked though, it's pretty, pretty stacked. Here's some of the Power Rangers and Master stuff. Some wrestling. Power Rangers, Joes. They got a full end cap here of a bunch of turtle stuff. They're definitely getting ready for Christmas though because there's toys like in aisles now. They got a transformer section over there. But like throughout the regular aisles, there's a bunch of just toys piled up. Whoa, look at this. I'm, I'm hoping they're resetting. I don't think anybody just dropped that. Kickflip, should I kickflip? Look, more turtles. Damn, this is a full on turtle section here. This Walmart might as well be called Turtle Mart. <laughs> Man, look at this fully stacked of Gambits. Gambit, Magneto, Rogue, Gambit, Gambit, Storm, Gambit, Bishop, Magneto. Dude, those X-Men 97s are sitting, but it's all Gambits and Magnetos and uh, Rogues and Storms and Bishop. No Wolverine. Toy hunting is gonna get a little crazier right now, especially with everybody doing their Christmas shopping. The, the, it's really flooded in the aisles. There's a lot of people around here too. So just be careful while you're out there, when you're out toy hunting, especially when you're walking in the, in the parking lots. And there's gonna be a lot of stealing going on because there's a lot of cops here too. All right, doing another target run. And you can see there is cops there. So during this holiday time, you see that a lot. And they're hiring guys. There's those uh, carts that were super hard to find one year. Um, okay, so the NECA section's down here. I found chases here before. I found early NECA releases here before. 
curious to see if I can find anything else. It's the new Star Wars stuff, or I don't even know if this is new to be honest with you, but it's an end cap with Star Wars stuff. Frankenstein, lanterns. Oh, no, there's nothing here. Oh, we got Toby, Sandman. Oh, it's cool to actually see these sitting here. They got a Magneto helmet. Actually, I think those might be on clearance. I think the shield is on sale too. There's three of them here. We also have some of the um, deluxe Aquaman figures. A couple of them. Is there Black Manta? No, these are just Aquaman and that fish guy. Okay. Um, I'm kind of curious to see though if um, if the uh, this is on sale. I don't think it is, but it's cool to see a Spider-Man No Way Home. Uh, Toby, not Toby, Tom Holland. Okay, so online this is at uh, 52. In store it's 150. So you're better off getting it online because it is. This is on sale at Target online for 52 dollars. I don't know. That's weird. I don't know why they just don't do 150 in store. So, I don't, if it was for 50 bucks, I'd get it. That's like a major FOMO. Here's some of the wrestling stuff that they have. A couple rocks, one there, one over here. There's that uh, hollow cam figure. Is that what it's called, hollow cam? Hollow com. Snow troopers, Millennium Falcons. It's always nice, when you see this guy in package, or me at least, it's major nostalgia. Oh, I totally forgot targets are doing these end caps. Who else is here? So there's just a couple Aquaman figures. I forgot there's a new end cap at Targets. So I gotta pay attention to that. All right, their NECA section is pretty much the same since the past few times that I've been here. I think I think this actually might be a chase of Aquaman. You guys ready? No, it's not. Okay. <laughs> um, look at all the bat. The oh, look, there's Alfreds right here. See that? Look at that. We've got an Alfred sitting here. So there's an Alfred, there's a Robin, Robin, Batman. There's Mr. Freeze back there, another Mr. Freeze. Batman, there's a lot of Batmans, but it's cool to actually, this is my second time, no, third time, because I found this guy earlier before its release, but I've seen it recently. What else do we have here? I don't see any new, new NECA items. The Thing, more Batman stuff, and another one over here. Robin, there's a Mr. Freeze on this side. They should be announcing the new wave soon because there's leaks of a bunch of animated series coming out. All right, that's it. All right, so I stopped by Ross to see if they have anything. There's a lot of freaking people in here right now. You know, I never, I totally forgot. I, for, I never found that G.I. Joe set. Okay, here we go. Into the toy section we go. Kick flip. Let's see what we have. Let's see if there's anything new. Because I know I see people piece posting um oh look. This is actually new. I don't think I've seen this one here before. Six dollars. Oh look what else they have. This is another good figure. Six bucks for the both, man. That's that's pretty damn good. Got more of these uh, skating TMNT figures. Man, there's like a lot of stuff here. Okay. What's this? Oh, it's Flash. It's over here. Okay, all right, let's go. Let's see where the action figures are. I think that might have been it, to be honest with you. But we'll see. Oh, we got some green arrows. We got one. I know people are finding a bunch of the uh, the chases here. There's a green arrow, and then there's also a, um, I found one of these here, the changers for $4. It's pretty crazy. I think there's something else here. No. Excuse me. I got pops. I didn't see these. Who's this? Gamora. Hey, look what I found. And this is actually something I'm going to get. $5. I got to get this. 
This is a Funko Shop exclusive, man, for five bucks. Oh, these are new little guys. I haven't seen these before. These are actually pretty cool. Are these banks? Yeah, I'm pretty sure these are banks. They got this one and they got, I think this is Demon Slayer. Yeah, they're definitely banks though. Oh, I haven't seen this figure in a while. Oh, look, here's a Sinclair, baby Sinclair. By the way, I'm at another Target. Here we go, baby Sinclair just chilling. Uh, we got some new TMNT, uh, what do you call it? Loyal subjects. And then the bikes. I actually think, I don't know if this is new. So many pop covers. What is this? I have not seen this in store in a while. What else do we got? Here's the covers. No new NECA stuff. Those are Elton John glasses. Just realized that. Pop, Stranger Things. I'm curious to know if these are on clearance, especially the Donnie. What else is back here? Spy these can't be on this can't be on clearance. This is the um uh Toby too. I don't know if there's a scanner around here. Yep, one right here. Right, we can scan this one and see if it's on clearance. Because a lot of these do go on clearance, but we'll see. Let's check it out. 24, so it's 24 right now. Original was what? 34, so it is on clearance. All right, let's go ahead and try the Donnie. Not Donnie, Leo. So we'll pick him up. Don't plan on picking this guy up like as far as a purchase, but just want to know if it is on clearance or not. Oh, what is that? Putting in new figures, Christmas, uh, Christmas area. Let's see, 31, original 44. So there you go, guys. These bad boys are on clearance. I think the She-Hulk is too, but she should have been on clearance like a while ago. I think these are on clearance too. The Super 7 glow-in-the-dark figures. I'm a sucker for glow-in-the-dark figures. You guys know that. Plus, reaction's awesome, and I'm a horror fan. But I doubt it. Let's let's take a look. Oh, the $13.99. Yeah, these are on clearance. That's uh, Frankenstein. And then, yeah, $13.99. The wrestling stuff and Star Wars stuff that they have. It's pretty jam packed here. Lots of retros. Alright, came to another Ross. I know there's um, more figures to be had, and I'm gonna have them. See if I can find them. Oh, here we go. Right here in the back is probably going to be a, a bunch of... Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. Venom poster. Okay. Let's see what we can find. If there is any more action figures. Oh, look. So this is my first time seeing one of these here. The spawns. This is six bucks, man. That is pretty... In, like, that's pretty crazy. To see a spawn figure here is pretty crazy. Oh, they got the Batmobiles here and the Batwings. Look at this, $3.99, the original is $11, no way. They had, I just saw another one, the Batman, look at this. This is pretty freaking cool. We got some Joes. There's a Ahsoka over here. I actually saw this in the previous one, I didn't film it though. That's pretty cool. Here's the, the uh, other one I saw in the guy's cart. This is $5, $5 for this guy, man. That's pretty crazy. And I know there's a lot of um, of Marvel Legends that are also going to be here. But I don't think... Oh, look at all these Joes. See, they have these ones here. So there's all these classified ones. It's pretty cool. Wow. What's this? Oh, here's another Joe. What the heck is this? Feels like it's repackaged. This is $6. Oh, we got some DC Multiverse. Look, there's more Joes. There's a lot of Joes in here. Look, there's like stacked back here. A couple more demons. There's another demon. We have Siren. Stay Puff. Here's another Green Arrow. What the heck is this? Green Arrow. I think there's a chase on the uh, Green Arrow. Oh, God. I'll put this up over here. Wolverine. Here's another Green Arrow. It's a regular version. Pretty sure there is a chase, though. See, there's one back there, too. If you guys can see him. We got Fish Face right back there. Man, there's a, there's a lot more stuff. I honestly thought they weren't going to like put more stuff out. And they, oh, geez, there's a freaking Shazam figure here. And this is such a great figure. Wow. 
That is pretty intense. Look, like it's another sin is what they're calling this guy. And there's another Dune deluxe figure back there. But I know there's like some McFarlane um, DC multiverse, but I think it's Black Adam. They have the deluxe figures too. I gotta really like dig in here though to see all this stuff. Ah oh, man, a lot of cool stuff. That's why I love coming to Ross. Ross, like during the holidays, is like the new Toys R Us. I don't think there's anything else though. That was a, that was pretty cool. I think I might go to one more. Jeez, look what they have here. Classics. $5.99. $5.99 for this. Look this like 30 bucks. This thing here, man. Six dollars. Jeez. All right, I'm gonna head into yet another Ross. And then Burlington's right next door. I don't know if Burlington's getting any new stuff, but definitely Ross. So let's let's give it a shot. Now this is the Ross where I came and I found all of those gold label Catwoman figures. So we're gonna see if uh, those are still here, plus any other new figures, because apparently that big 10 inch spawn figure, Mal Maliath, I always forget that guy's name. I always wanna call him like Goliath or Monolith, but apparently that's here too. What's the exit? Pretty surprising. Uh, the times that I've been here or any other Ross, it's usually packed and there's like nobody in here compared to how it normally is. Okay, the tables now. Oh, what the hell? Look at this, Thor's hammer. I did not know this was gonna be at a Ross. What's the price on this? $34. Is this really in here though? Smashed, but Thor's hammer is $34, guys. That is pretty freaking crazy. Dude, that is a pretty crazy find to see Thor's hammer just chilling here. Um, let's see what else we got. See, the, um, the other one had this. I didn't show it, but they had a bunch of the Funko shop exclusives, which I did get of the Batman. We got the Legend of Vox Machina. I think I said that right. Over here, usually at the end cap, you'll find some action figures. Oh, they got ACDC. I got one of these from my dad, the black and white exclusive on one of their albums, $7.99. It's a pretty good deal. What else do we have? Okay, so the action figures are down on this side. And again, this is where I saw all those gold label Catwomans, which seem to be gone. Oh, I see a new Joe. I see a new Joe figure there. Okay, so some Joes here. I've seen those ones before, but they have that one with like the, uh, I think it's a crocodile or an alligator. Some more figures. Okay, they don't, they don't have a lot of action figures here that I'm looking for from McFarlane. Yeah, all those gold labels are gone. They are gone. The Catwomans were like stacked up here. Somebody definitely took those. But these are the Joes I was telling you about that I've never seen here. And I usually see these at Walmart and these are $11.99. How, how dope is that to see these bad boys here? Oh, dude, they got some, I don't know if I've seen this one before, but they have Warhammer figures here. That's pretty, this is $8.99. And then they also have another Thor hammer here. That, that is so awesome. Dude, I almost left with that Thor hammer. That was that would have been just a major FOMO buy. I didn't even want, I didn't even want it. I think just the fact that you see it there for so cheap makes you want that uh, item. So there's two of them there. Um, I didn't really see anything else in there that I wanted, but dude, these sales that you, you're finding at Ross is pretty crazy. Burlington was the cool one at first, but now it's like Ross is coming right back. It's like they're battling each other. Like who has the best stuff? So I'm walking into Bur Burlington right now. All right, right off the bat, there's this table here with a bunch of uh, like anime stuff and Funko stuff and video game stuff too. Oh man, there's so much stuff at Burlington. It's pretty freaking crazy. And Ross is combined. Let's see what's in here. Anime, My Hero Academia, Lucky Charms. We got some more pops on this side. There's the two packs of the turtles. Let's see if there's a Pennywise in here. Which there should be, but there isn't. My Hero Academia. Okay. But well, let's see if there's anything back on this side. The one thing I'm really happy that I got off my list was getting was um, purchasing the uh, the Batman light. That's one thing I'm really happy that I found. Um, now it's just like a matter of what I'm going to find on clearance at Ross and and at uh, Burlington. So the hunt's never gonna stop. Yeah. Wow, this toy section is insane. Look at all this stuff. Dude, there's so much stuff everywhere. All right, where to begin? Like where would, 
the toys be, like the action figures. This is where I found the Shao Kahn and the Jokers. It's the first time I saw, and I knew those were even here. Let's see, some stuff in here mixed in. All right, a Shazam figure. What else do we have on this side? Nope, all right. I think the only cool thing that I can see so far is just the bat wings. I got a couple of them here. I think I was originally I seen these at um this stuff's gonna fall. Originally I seen these at Ross. So I don't know what the prices are here, because at Ross is where I originally saw these. And these are priced at $12.99. It's not bad. Okay, I did find a couple things here, and it's these ones, the Power Rangers. I remember these went on clearance at Target, so now these are new here. These are ten dollars. I want, I don't know what the prices were when Target had these on clearance. There's a few of them here, but there's no real any other action figures. I have this Culture Fly Nightmare for seven bucks. That's about it. All right, walked into a Walmart real quick just to see what they got, and I think in a couple more hours, maybe three hours, I'm going to be heading to some more Rosses because they close at um, eleven o'clock or I think midnight. So we'll be going to some more Rosses. All right, so far, doesn't look like there's anything new here. They got some Joes, um, Super 7s. Mortal Kombat Cabal, have not seen that one in a while. Oh, snap, look what they have. I haven't seen this set in a while either. This is a pretty damn good set too. No freaking way. Look, look what I just spotted here. I think this might be my first chase that I've seen at a Walmart. But I have this one already. It was just sitting right there. That is pretty awesome to see. Here's the rest of the DC stuff. And again, doesn't look like there's a whole lot. Actually, I can't say there's a whole lot of new stuff here. There isn't a whole lot of new stuff here because last time it was here, this one wasn't here. Um, but these are the ones that are showing up at Ross for I think five or six dollars. Still a pass for me though. They have Batwing over there. Let's see what else we got. I don't really see a whole lot here though. Star Wars, Page Punchers, a Hulk Hogan, The Rock with a guitar, some some Joe sets. Oh, that, are these new? I've never seen these before. I actually think these might be new. Oh, there's a uh, Moss Man too. Now the turtle stuff is definitely, definitely stocked with the retros and uh, the new stuff. No no real Marvel Legends here either. A lot of the same stuff that's been sitting here. There's some more vin uh, retro ones up top. Is that, uh, oh, I was gonna say, is that a Jurassic Park of retro too? I wanna see if this is actually on clearance right now, so I gotta get a price check on this. We'll see. Can I get a price check if you don't mind? Okay, okay. thank you, appreciate it. Oh, sorry. I have not been in this GameStop in a long time. This GameStop here, used to have, this used to be like the biggest place that sold collectibles. Let's see what they have now. How's it going? Oh, I think I got some pretty cool stuff. Oh, their setup in here is pretty good. Those are cool. Man, they actually do got a lot of figures here though. Here's uh, some of their clearance items that they have. Nothing cool. Damn, this place, this is still, looks pretty good. You know, look at that huge Boba Fett pop up top. All right, let's see what else they got. Yeah, they got a lot of collectibles at this one. I think these, oh, this is the one that um, T3, this looks like him. He, T3 said this doesn't look like Christopher Walken. It actually looks just like him. Man, you're crazy, bro. Don't know what you're talking about. There's a chase back here, though. That's just like the most common chase from McFarland that I think you'll ever find. Oh, here we go. Here we go. And it's a Batman only. Dang it. Can't believe it. Oh, they got the seahorse. No way. Dude, look at this. Man, that is crazy. But to think that they have these they have these now in store is pretty insane. They got these. Man, no Robin, nobody else. That is pretty crazy to see like all of these here. Damn. Wow. That is cool. That is really, really cool. Look at that. The seahorse. I know a lot of people are looking for that. Whoa, I don't think I've seen this before. This might be new. I don't think I've ever seen this version. Dude, this GameStop's pretty freaking legit. It's unfortunate though that they have they have these, man. 
But I guess I obviously missed out on finding the rest of the figures. I mean, unless they're somewhere around here, which I highly doubt. There's some more Star Wars Christmas. And here's the Star Wars stuff. Well, I don't know if I've seen that before. I probably have. Let's see what else we can find here. Here we got this side over here. Dark. Is this new? I don't know if. It's... Whoa, whoa, whoa! I'm gonna see if we have any cases, dude. This place still has lots of collectibles. I just saw this one on clearance. I think this might be new. Dragons. Joes. Diablo. I think these are the new. McFarlane's. Yeah, these are new. Yeah. Oh, look at all this stuff. Some statues. Dude, they got a lot of stuff here. Helmets up top. Wow. Lots and lots of stuff. Yeah, I think this might be new. I think this is new. I don't know. Oh, look at this. Oh, and that. I don't think I've ever seen it. I don't think I've seen any of these. Wow. Here's a pop stuff. Great selection of pops. Really good selection of pops. And see up top, look at this. Dude. A TLC album, too. All right, so I don't feel that bad. Uh, apparently, they just got only those two in today. He said he literally just put those out. I kind of want to go to another GameStop. This one, they started, they're closing at 10. No. Oh, no, they're closing at 9. Holiday hours. Let's see, November. Okay. So, they're closing at 9 o'clock. I doubt there's another one, but it's a while away. I would not make that. All right, going to try another Ross to see if we find any more cool clearance items. And the Target's right down the way. Ooh, what do we have? Green arrow, green arrow, green arrow. There's lots of green arrows. Another green arrow. It's got to be a chase. Huh? Oh, this is a new one that I haven't seen here. The Flash, $5.99. It's cool. Let's see what else is in here. Right, this one might be promising. Come on, Jay. All right, we're at the tables to see what they have. Roblox, more stuff. Trying to find out where the figures are. So they have like this whole section right here just of randomness. Jaren. Cool ships, cool vehicles, you know? Okay, here we go, here we go. Let's see. Pops, 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 X-Men. Uh, I don't see any figures. Let's see. Let's see if we can, what's this one? This is Madam Hydra, $6 for that one. It's pretty cool. A lot of Transformers, I'm seeing more Transformers, at least those, these types of Transformers here. Is what I'm seeing a lot of now. Oh, very little section. Kale. Well, I literally just saw this at GameStop and I said, oh, is this new? This is what I just saw at GameStop. $5.99. What's there? Another demon. This right here is a uh, Ross exclusive it's the only way to get this guy oh there's another captain hook this is actually really cool though i do like that what is over here nothing well, i guess that's it there's not there's not um anything different i mean there's a lot of good stuff but nothing different that i've seen from the previous previous ones I have to really scan through everything to make sure i don't miss anything you know, this is pretty cool. 12 days of socks. These are all the socks that you get. What's the price on this thing? 15. Damn, this is a cool Venom poster, man. This is the Venom that I grew up with. Like this art style of Venom. Oh, man. 
Eleven ninety nine too. All right, here we go. I well, came to Target, by the way. I didn't show the uh, me walking in. Um, but there's nothing. There is nothing to be had here. It's like the excitement nowadays is more so going to a uh, like a Ross, which uh, yes, to buy this instead of paying full price, full price for it. It's crazy that it's sitting here, but it's also sitting at Ross for less than half the price, which is pretty good. Uh, no pops either. Damn, someone, someone ate it. All right, here's the fig section. Batman, DC. What's Aquaman? Oh, like a peg warmer. See, I knew this one was going to be the peg warmer. That one and um, Matt Murdock and possibly Sandman are the peg warmers. X-Men. Here's the... I think this is the one that I saw last time. I think this is the new one. I don't think it's any different than the other one. Pretty sure this is it. All right. Um, I, I don't even know which ones of these are even new. But they got. it looks like they got some new Joes here. And also the Aquaman. Just all Aquaman? What the heck is this? What the heck is this, dude? I've never seen anything like this. What the? What is this? What? <laughs> dude, what is this? Th this looks, this just looks wrong. Why is he naked? Gonna check out another, can you read that? Ross. And possibly Walmart right after. Yes, Jacob's saying yes. Ooh. We got train sets. Spider-Man stuff. From the back of this. Pianos. All right, where are the figures at? Dude, this one is stacked with stuff. Um, we've got a lot of pops for one. Some Joes, Scarecrows, a Vision here. Flash. So this is a Green Arrow. Flash. Green Arrow. Let's see what else we can find in here. Damn, dude. There's like a bunch of stuff in here. It doesn't look like it's even really been picked through. See, look at this. More. Okay, here's some more spawn. Oh, shoot. Check who's in here. Okay, so this one's $9 for this one. That's my first time seeing seeing that one here. Um, who's this? Dude, I just saw this at GameStop, too. Okay, so there's that. Who else do we have? There's Hero, a lot of Hero Academia. This is a new one I haven't seen yet. Robin, $6. I think that's based off of the video game. But a lot of these um, spawn ones are here. Yeah, that's just pr pretty good finds. Man, that was a lot of DC Multiverse that they had here. That John Stewart and that Wonder Woman one are actually pretty cool. I don't know where their toy section that's here. Watch that be the only area. Oof, man, I walked right into the posters. And there's a Zelda one. And there's two Zelda ones. Okay, there's that one. And there's that one. Ooh, that's the one I wanted originally. Dang it. That was another one over here. Look at this one. Oh, yeah. oh dude, that Joker clock is freaking sick. Okay, I found it. Found the figures. I'm going to say, like, based off of what was in the front, I wonder if there's going to be good stuff here. See some Star Wars in here. They have um, Anakin, three ninety nine. What is this Power Ranger thing here? Oh, that was like a replica, like a helmet or something. Dude, there's this one's got a lot of stuff like stuffed in. Let's see, I don't see any DC stuff or any Marvel stuff. I still haven't found the multiple man. That's the that's the one thing I wanna I wanna see is the multiple man, the X-Men multiple man Marvel Legends. Is this it? Is this really gonna be it? Let's see what else we have on the tables. No, no. Oh, there's still stuff over there. Dang it. Look at all this. Jeez man, there's so much stuff everywhere. Oh wow. Okay, what do we see over here? Nothing, but look at this. To walk through this is pretty crazy. There might be some figures over here. It's what if. Oh man. Oh, here we go. We have Flash again. Uh, this is a different Wonder Woman. This is actually a Build-A-Figure. This is an older wave. 
some more green arrows over here. Boba Fett. It's a Halo set for $10. This is 10 bucks right here. Um, another green arrow. And there's some more Halos. Another Wonder Woman. Some Mario stuff. My Hero Academia. Oh, man. I can't even walk in this place. Um, Dune. Some more Dune stuff. McFarlane. A lot more McFarlane stuff over here. McFarlane. There's the Dune guy. Power Ranger back here. Who's this? This is Dino Charge for probably five bucks, six bucks. There's another doing one right there. This one's, yeah, five dollars, man. It's freaking crazy. Flash. There's more figures on the other side. There's some Jurassic Park. Oh, this is pretty cool. Don't know what that is, but that's cool. Turtles. There's the Anakin again. What else? Looks like that might be... This actually might be it. Right. Oh, there's freaking baby Anakin. Slinky. We got over here. Maximum. Little soldiers task force. Damn, yeah, they even got this guy here. I didn't even think. I think this might be actually a hard figure to come by for six bucks. Oh man, some of the more Power Rangers in here. What is? This is like five bucks. Lots of scarecrows, like I said. Joe's. What if? What if? What if? What if? That General Zod. Who is this? It is General Zod. Hey, look at this Spider-Man clock. The amazing Spider-Man. This is uh, eight bucks, man. Dude, this is awesome. This is really cool. All right, this is the last spot of the day. And then we're calling it a day. We're going to good old Walmart. All right, dude, they got their music blasting here. I should have brought my freaking mic because in places like this, when the toys are blasting, that's when you get copyright here. Okay, uh, here we go. Let's see what they have. Fuck. Oh, here, I don't know if this is new. Actually, this actually might be old. I feel like I've seen this a while ago. Oh, dude, I feel like I haven't seen this guy in a freaking minute. And here he is. And they actually have the new DC superpowers here at Walmart. They got Aquaman and the very awesome. Yeah, I guess this place doesn't have any NECA. Or like any action figures on this side. I mean, they have these. But there's no figures. This TV series. Xena. I do want to get Xena on uh, on DVD. Also, the Hercules, the series. Oh, man, I've been wanting the Beetlejuice one, too. And I don't even know why. I never really grew up watching it. I think I've only seen a few episodes. There it is. A full wave of the X-Men 97. Magneto, Bishop, Ga uh, Rogue, Wolverine, and then Storm, and uh, Gambit. I think so far I only, have, I only have Gambit. I need to get all of them because this is such a great line. And they're, they're all fantastic. Um, so I'll jump on these eventually, but such a cool line. All right, I'm gonna call it quits. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. There was a lot of stuff to be found. And I honestly didn't pick up anything other than that Funko Pop uh, shop exclusive, the Batman. I would have gotten the um, Manor, Manor, the Thor hammer, but I'm not even a Thor fan like that. And plus I hated that freaking movie. But um, there's a lot of stuff on there. If you guys saw anything in there that you liked or that you are out there looking for at Ross's or wherever, let me know in the comments down below. Also, it was really cool to see the Batman and Robin figures. Well, just Batman at GameStop. And then they also had the Seahorse. So, guys, thumbs up the video. Thumbs up the video, guys. And uh, we'll see you guys soon. Thank you for watching. Peace.